Hey, how's everybody doing today? Hopefully everybody's all right, all right. So today I'm gonna to show you these really cool business card holders. Um, you know, if you're into real estate, you sell cars, you sell soda machines, you're an actor model, you're gonna want a business card holder that is nice, clean, keeps your cards with sharp edges, all that good stuff. So these are the two highest rated ones on Amazon. So this is the Samsung on the right, has a 4.5 rating out of 448 reviews, sells for only $7. So on the left, we have the Wisdom Pro. As you can see, it has its logo on it. This one's clean, by the way, no logos. It could make a difference to people. So the Wisdom Pro has a 4.5 rating as well, with 344 reviews, sells for $8. Also comes in eight colors. Uh, besides black, you get brown, pink, purple, so a nice variety. And I believe the Samsil is only black. Uh, also, these are both, well, the Samsil is definitely leather, so it claims, and I believe it is. And the Wisdom Pro, I think, is synthetic leather or it's a mix. Um, so you want to check that out. But they're both very smooth. I think they'll both last a very long time. Um, I like them both, the look and the feel and the texture. So let's open up the Samsil. Now, as you can see, it looks very nice, very clean, again, smooth. They got five business cards on the left. You know, they come out relatively easy. Not too bad, right? And then I got four ID type cards, although you can see I got it from like a movie theater just because I want to hide my ID and contact info. But it holds four pretty good. They come out pretty easy, you know, so that's good. But I have to admit, both of these in general, when I first bought them, they were very tight. Um, I let these sit overnight with the cards, and they're a little easier today. So in time, you know, like leather, they will stretch, and then you can put more cards um, in here, which would come in handy. Uh, so that's the Samsil. So now we got the Wisdom Pro. Okay, let's open that up. And the first thing, I don't know if you notice that, it actually has a magnet you know, right here, which is pretty cool. So that keeps it closed, nice and flush. Some people like playing with magnets. So I remember when I was younger, I used to have a horseshoe magnet. You know, to pick up nails and coins and whatnot. Maybe even uh, Hot Wheels cars, I don't know. All right, so same idea. We got five cards on the left. Show you in the back. Um, I noticed it also has a cardboard lining here, if you can see that groove a little bit. So that's actually gonna protect your cards more. It's gonna make this more, I don't know, boxy, I guess you could say. So the cards won't bend. Um, but at the same time, between that and if we can look inside a little bit on the end, it's hard to see though. It's got ruffles from, I guess, the stitching. So I noticed sometimes when I was taking these out, the tips were catching. I don't know if you can see it on the camera that well, but the tips were catching, so it was actually roughing the edges on the front card, front card only a little bit. And that's only after a day's use. Um, so over time, that front card could get banged up, but you could always just keep that in there, you know, and pull from the back every time. Just a minor observation. You know, I learned. Um, so I got four cards over here on this side. Again, come out pretty easy. Uh, and this is more boxy. I think this actually fits the cards easier as opposed to the Sam cell. But that's because the Sam cell is thinner. And you're actually going to want probably the thinnest possible. So you can see it is a little thinner, right? But you can also see it's a little taller. Let me check out, see the height and then the width. Wisdom Pro is a little shorter, a little smaller, but again, it's definitely wider. So you say, well, how wide? You know, I want to fit in my front pocket kind of easy, so I'll take measurements for you. So this is a Wisdom Pro. As you can see, it's probably about, I don't know, what, two and three-fourths or two, a little more than two and a half inches. Then we check the length, four inches wide. And we got the Samsung. Got about two and three quarters inch. And then we check out the length and one and a quarter. So they're both pretty close guys, not too much of a difference, but again, this is smaller um, and this is taller. You know, that's kind of the main thing you can see and this is thicker. So again, two of the highest, best rated ones on Amazon. Highly recommend them. I'll put links in the description where you can purchase them on Amazon. Uh, any questions or comments, leave them in the comment box below. I just got these, but hopefully I can help you out, you know. So, 
Give it a thumbs up if you can, if you like this video. Subscribe, ring that little bell so you get notifications. Because in general, I like doing these comparison videos. So I hope to do more in the future, and I have some in the past. So that's about it, guys, for now. So take it easy, and have a great rest of your day. All right, all right.